So it's Monday, so that means it's time for Industry Insight. And there's a burgeoning industry out there that some people say is on the brink of uh, revolutionizing the world. It's 3D printing, and it could be one of the key technologies of the 21st century. Now, Kim Jong tells us more about the 3D printing industry right here in Korea. In the beginning, it was the cool factor that early adopters recognized from 3D printing. And the early players like Stratasys, 3D Systems, and Shapeways from the U.S. and Japan's DMM were quick to cater to hobbyists and industrialists with an eye on the future. In Korea, those first in line for a 3D printer include researchers in the medical sector looking for innovative ways to treat patients. For example, a local hospital, St. Mary's Hospital of Catholic University, successfully performed an artificial joint treatment earlier this year by using 3D printing to make customized prototypes. And the hospital says it wants to try to expand the technology to make functioning organs in the future. Other large hospitals are racing to patent the three-dimensional printing technology that will be used for skull or dental implants and drug delivery agents in the human body. And, but despite these promising signs, the 3D printing technology is currently in its infant stages in Korea. Barriers like price and usability are preventing mainstream users from getting their hands on the technology. But some 3D printing companies are trying to change that. Take a look. 3D printers aren't as commonly used by average consumers in Korea because of its huge price tag. The hardware sells at around 2,000 U.S. dollars. In order to break down such economic barriers, 3D developer founded by its parent trading company, Media International Trade, launched a leasing and rental program for the public. Uh, we want to lead uh, uh, more people can use the 3D printing technology because we believe this is a very good thing. It is very really good, good for the industrial efficiency. Also, it can help people to get their own customized product. Also, they can change people's uh, lifestyle. So, uh, in order to think to expand this new technology, we were trying to watch what is the really barrier of the market. With monthly rental fees set at 35 U.S. dollars and an option to buy at the end of a two-year contract period, the company says its printer leasing program creates easier accessibility for customers to try the new hardware. The program also assures the machine will continue to operate properly, even after its purchase. The company says its customers are not limited to a specific group, but includes manufacturers of toys and jewelry, as well as R&D centers, universities, and ordinary people. Yeah, for example, we can, we can try to make my own shoes. Maybe yeah, somebody can scan my feet, and then maybe we can design. We can, we can change some, some design to make my own shoes, and then I can just print it. Another company is also trying to widen the use of 3D printers by making the hardware more easy to use for the average customer. Open Creators, the country's first startup company in the 3D printing industry, says its printer, called the Almond, is by far the easiest printer to use yet. For most people, it takes just the afternoon to get it up and running. Almond has an auto-leveling function. It checks nine points of a surface and adjusts the appropriate slope of the bed, eliminating the need for the user to manually attach any nuts and bolts. Also, there's a cooling pen that brings down the temperature of the melted material, which improves printing quality. And for consumers who are worried about looks, the Almond has both substance and style. It was awarded some of the world's most renowned design awards, including the Red Dot and Idea Awards. Open Creator says it's working toward a vision to try to create an atmosphere, a culture where every household has a 3D printer in their homes, equivalent to appliances like TVs and vacuum cleaners. The company offers a weekly workshop open to anyone who wants to maximize the utility of its product. These efforts by the 3D printing industry are expected to open up the technology to the mainstream and pave the way for more specialized applications to become a part of our everyday lives. Kim Jeong, Arirang News.